Hey Weavers and Amigals, welcome back to my channel. We got a giant box in the mail that I am super excited to open with you guys. It has been sent by Bandai Aww. Namco. Thank you again, the team at Bandai. I really do appreciate the support that you continuously give to me, my channel, of course to you guys as well. Thank you so much for the support all these years. I do have a Patreon at patreon.com slash Chris down below in the description. So if you want to support my channel and you want to get custom amiibo, prizes, Nintendo DIYs, definitely check out my Patreon. I do appreciate it. We're just going to jump right into this box. It is bigger than the last box that I got from Bandai. That's why I am super excited to open it with you. Okay, so this is the giant box that I got from Bandai. I am really excited. I have no clue what this is. None. We're going to open this right now. I have a lot of projects going on, especially with Nintendo, which of course I'm super excited for all the opportunities that I've gotten and will get in the near future. <sighs> I just gotta thank you guys. I wouldn't be working with these companies if it weren't for you guys. So thank you again. Don't forget to like and subscribe before we open this box real quick because I do appreciate it and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna forget to tell you guys. Okay, so I'm gonna cut the tape off on both ends. Do not open boxes the way I open boxes because this is really dangerous. <laughs> okay, so um, I got the seal off. Oh my gosh, I can do everything when it comes to DIYs, but I don't know how to open a box. Let's look inside, let's look inside, I'm so excited. This is so random, so freaking random. I haven't looked yet, I haven't looked. What is this? Oh, they sent me a nice letter. Yes, oh my gosh. Okay, wait, <laughs> this is so awesome. Dude, you guys have no idea. So if you saw my first Bandai Namco unboxing, which you can check that out, I'll have that link down below as well. This goes hand in hand. And you guys know that I love to collect figurines. I am a figurine maker as well, especially when it comes to custom amiibos. So this is right up my alley. I'm flipping out right now, guys, because, dude, it's a freaking figurine. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna take this out. Are you ready? I just saw the top, but huh, huh, oh, that's the back. <laughs> it is, oh I do, it is Rapide from Tales of Vesperia, and he had sent me the deluxe edition as well. Now guys, we have the actual figurine. Let me know if you've ever played the Tales of series. Favorite of all the games has to be Tales of Symphonia, just because I have a lot more memories that I've made with that game when it comes to like my sisters and us playing late at night and early morning. But Tales of Vesperia is such an amazing title and it's crazy because I've asked a lot of people, well, what would you like more, like Tales of Vesperia or Tales of Symphonia? And everyone says they slightly like Tales of Vesperia just a little more. This is so gorgeous. And it's crazy because it's coming full circle. I actually remember telling you guys that I made a repeat for a friend of mine because they didn't come out with a repeat figurine, so I made one for her. Please um, understand that it's really old and it was probably one of my first figurines that I've ever made, so it's, it's not that good. But this figurine is official, is probably gonna look amazing, and I get to unbox it with you guys. So it's crazy how in life things come around and uh, it's just so, it's so weird and I love it. So I'm gonna try to slip the cover off. Bandai, you guys are spoiling me like crazy. Oh my gosh. They also have another game that I'm super interested in. And um, you guys know me, I love going to EVO. I love fighting games, competitive games. They also have Jump Force and I'm super interested in that too as well. But, uh, <laughs> so I took off the cover and I just have to open it. I'm gonna open it right now. Ooh, and I heard like the vacuum seal. It was so weird. Okay, okay, cool. Ooh, new box smell. Oh gosh. Dude, okay, oh, I love figurines. Okay, what is the thicker part? Because I feel like this is gonna fall. I'm gonna break it. You guys, I'm so clumsy. Uh. <laughs> okay, ready? 
set. Yo, yo, we got a new dog, guys, and he is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Okay, so I'm going to take him out of the wrapping. And he has felt at the bottom too, which I love because a lot of figurines tend to not have that felt. So when it sits on the table, you can hear it slide. And so there's the official seal as well. You have the Tales of Vesperia right here logo on there as well, which looks really good. The details on the grass, on his toes, on his body, on his nose. It is so cute. Wow, we're just gonna inspect him a lot closer. I'm missing something. <laughs> Pipe that he has that goes in his mouth. Oh, it's so cute, guys. But he has some weight to him, which is really nice because I know a lot of figurines tend to be hollow, but what I've noticed from Bandai is that they put a lot of quality checks to make sure that what you get is definitely of high standards. He's almost done, and we have one more thing that we gotta do. He is so cute! Let me know at home if you guys have a dog. I used to have two dogs. One was a golden retriever and one was a husky. They both passed away, sadly, from old age. The golden retriever reached the age of 15, and then the husky reached the age of 16. The husky's name was Tundra. There's a spiral level, which is basically like full of snow and stuff. We decided to name her Tundra because she's a husky. Reno, being a golden retriever, Retriever. He was found in Reno, Nevada. So let me know if you guys have pets at home. I love dogs. I know me and Jason are going to get eventually a dog of our own. That'll be our first child. We still have to do the Q&A. So if you have any questions for me and Jason in the next video, let me know down below. <laughs> Gonna slip that on. I love figurines. Let me know if you guys collect figurines as well. I just love looking at them, especially when I go to a comic book store and I see like DC and Marvel and all the characters. I just look at the amount of detail that they put. This is repeat, guys. He looks so beautiful. Honestly, you just take it out of the box, you put the chain on and the pipe, and he's ready to be displayed. I highly suggest that once again, you definitely check out this game. I've heard amazing reviews. Thank you so much, Dimitri and the team at Bandai Namco. They know I love figurines. You just build this type of understanding how much work it takes to make a figurine. All the links will be down below in the description so you can get your own puppers. He is so cute. I absolutely enjoyed the game. Again, thank you for the support, Bandai Namco. Thank you to you guys for years of support, you and me bros and amigals. I love you all. There are new Nintendo DIYs coming very soon, including a new custom amiibo tutorial and a lot more. We still have Evo coming up as well as E3, and I would love to bring you guys along. So make sure you like and subscribe to this video. Thank you so much, and I will see you in the next video. <laughs>